The Vols, they are going to be wearing all black alternate uniforms on Saturday against South Carolina. It's a move players have wanted for years to see again. Happened last time back in 2009. Big Orange unveiled the new look Tuesday. 10 Sports David Sheely joins us with how coach made it happen. David. Hey, Robin and John, this New Jersey has football fans going crazy. I'm talking about fans who support Tennessee and those who don't. Folks who can't stand the Vols have confessed that these are fire. Now I know that I know there's those who don't like the jersey and would rather see the Vols stick to orange and white, but here are the players' reactions, and they're the ones who actually have to wear the black uniforms. They like it. It's all part of the culture that Coach Heupel wants to build on Rocky Top. To me, the player experience is at the forefront of everything that we do, right? There's non-negotiables from, from myself and, and our coaching staff and, and how you got to attack every day, whether that's in the weight room, whether that's class, whether that's on the football field, right? But then there, there's some things that you want to give them ownership in and make the player experience as good as it can be on and off the field. Uniforms is something that, that uh, it's, it's important to them. And, and uh, in some ways, it's important in the recruiting uh, world as well. And it's also a good recruiting tool when fans are buying the jerseys. This was the highest sold product on Fanatics.com on Wednesday across all leagues, <laughs> including professional, John. Everyone's buying them. That says a lot. David, thanks for the perspective. The Vols do take on South Carolina this weekend. The game set for noon at Neyland. If you're headed to the game, the gates open at 10. If not, you can watch it on ESPN2. Up 